सो हेलो माई डियर सब्सक्राइबर्स वेलकम बैक टू द चैनल गाइज सो हाउ यू गाइज आर डूइंग एंड दिस वीडियो इज ऑल अबाउट द रिव्यू ऑफ फाइनली द रिव्यू ऑफ Hugo Sanchez the iconic card so before we move on to this particular video hello guys we welcome back to the channel guys the discord link has been given in the description you can tap in the link in the description you can join the discord server you can go on the instagram you can tap the search button you can type rock fc mobile you will be able to find my profile there guys just don't forget to follow me there so that it can motivate me a lot so that i can make some of the amazing content for you guys as well so this is the most demanded review of course so i know that you guys are just totally excited for this review even I was really excited to test him out, guys. So let's go and let's see how good is Hugo Sanchez. So, guys, as you can see here, first of all, we gonna purchase as I purchased him for approximately 100 million coins. You know, the 99 rated version. That's really huge. A 99 rated card striker for that coins is really a you know steal. So let's go for actually placing him up in this formation, guys. One of the most important thing. Don't uh, miss uh, do the mistake in using Sanchez as a solo striker. Don't use him solo striker. I will again say I tested him in various head to head matches and I found that he is very good as at the. Dual striker formation. So I'm gonna commit Vinicius Junior because he is actually you know the untradeable card and of no use of me because we will be going to get Rivaldo for the left wing of course. So let's actually give the skill points towards dexterity and it's gonna boost you know 15 points. So the center forward position might be better for uh, Sanchez. You know, 130 pace guys at just 20 level. That that's look that 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 really looks awesome. You know. Very high acceleration, some good agility, some good short power. Physical stats are decent as well. Nice jumping, and he is having some uh, great weak foot skills. And so there we go. And I tested in the various head to head matches. There we go, Hugo Sanchez. Guys, his strength is decent. It's not very special, you know. Well, when the tall defenders actually go close to him, he gets he gets bottled there. But anyways, let's go. It's De Jong. Ball towards Charzinho. I'm gonna pass towards Hugo Sanchez. Fake shot. Another fake shot will shoot the finesse. That's a nice goal with the help of his strong foot, of course. I like that. You know. So there we go towards Charzinho. Ball towards Hugo Sanchez. Gonna go with the heel to heel. Still running. Skill sun is decent in my opinion. Let's go for the scoop turn again with the open up fake shot. We'll go for a type of scoop turn. We'll go for the open up fake shot. Nice skill stun with the strong foot in the back of the net. That's a nice goal by Hugo Sanchez. So right now, guys, I'm playing him in the. Dual striker formation. Don't play him solo striker. I'm again saying you will actually get frustrated if you play solo. But look at the speed, guys. In dual striker, his speed is so awesome. With a fake shot, shoots the finesse from the strong foot in the back of the net again. That's a nice thing because in dual striker, you know the uh, responsibility becomes less for a striker. There we go. Pass the ball towards De Jong. Towards Hugo Sanchez. Shoots. Oh, look at the shot. His shooting feels, you know, really special. Like the strong foot is so good in my opinion, guys. There we go. It's Ruben Diaz. It's Jarzinho. Ball towards Sanchez will go for the heel to heel. He's still going. Will go for the fake shot. Want to strike from that angle with the strong foot in the back of the net, and that's a beautiful goal by Hugo Sanchez. Okay, I like this shot. Was really amazing, you know, guys. That's 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 De Jong. That's De Jong. That's De Jong. Jarzinho. Ball towards Colo Muani. Gonna take on the back side towards Hugo Sanchez. What what a run, guys. Taps over, stun, shoots. Top shots, guys. He has gotten top shots from his strong foot. You know, it feels so amazing to shoot. Only downside is the physicality and the height and the skill stun. But look at his positioning as well. Hugo Sanchez, what a beautiful! Oh, like just look at the shot, guys. So beautiful. You know, I just enjoyed while shooting with him. You know, let's go. It's Sanchez heel to heel. Ah, he got in. You know, Blanc was there, but Sanchez is still on the ball. Gonna pass the through pass towards Jarzinho. Again towards Sanchez. Gonna strike the power shot. Shoots. What a goal. What a nice goal. Again by Hugo Sanchez. Let's pass the ball towards Sanchez. Again gonna go with the heel to heel. Still going inside. And ah, oh, this is the problem. No, I was telling like his skill stun, physicality is little bit problem. That's why don't play him as the. Uh, a lone striker, but the dual striker formation is totally killer, guys. Let's go. Jarzinho ball towards Colo Muani, but Sanchez is on it. I'm gonna go with the open a fake shot, stun them, shoots the ball. Beautiful goal from the strong foot in the back of the net again. Let's go. Ball towards Zambrota, and it's a ball towards Hugo Sanchez towards you know uh, Endo towards ball Colo Colo Muani, Colo Muani passing the ball towards Sanchez with the fake shot. Weak foot is implanted, shoots. 
That's a nice goal towards the right corner of the goal in the back of the net again. Jairzinho. Jairzinho passing the ball towards Hugo Sanchez. Gonna take him at this side. And this time we're gonna go with the scoop turn. Let's go. Oh my god. Look at this beautiful scoop turn. Type of fake shot. Shoots the ball with the strong foot in the back of the net again. That's an excellent goal. Scoop turns are really solid, guys. Of course, his dribbling feels, you know, very amazing. Sanchez. Open a fake shot. Accelerating very fast, of course. 130 pace at the 20 level feels very good. And his finishing is really good, in my opinion. Yes, I can say that, guys. From the strong foot, finishing looks too good. Kolo Muani towards Sanchez. Open a fake shot. Accelerating so fast. Beaten Bastoni gonna strike the power shot. Let's shoot. Oh my god. Look at the shot, guys. So that's all for the gameplay of Hugo Sanchez. Now let's talk about the conclusion, guys. One of the most important point. Don't use him at the solo striker, okay? Use him at the dual striker. Okay, if you are using two striker formation and you really want a high OVR, the cheaper card, then you can definitely go for Hugo Sanchez. Of course, guys, he's really good in my opinion. He's a new card as well. His pace was very good. His skill stun is decent because of the short height. We have to manage that, you know. But his shooting was really top. It was really, really top in my opinion. I'm going to post the next video, the comparison between the team of the year, Cristiano Ronaldo, Hugo Sanchez and Crespo, of course. So just don't forget to press the bell icon. But before that, you have to press the subscribe button guys so don't forget to subscribe this channel and to press the bell icon so that you cannot miss any further notification of such type of amazing videos of course thanks for watching guys love you all and let's meet in the another head-to-head -head comparison video jay hind